Hello everyone, today I am going to show you how we will check a string is balanced or not. Since we are passing a uh, st string of uh, unbalanced or balanced brackets, so I need to make sure this bracket, bracket is balanced or not. So when I go in here, I will make a class here in IntelliJ. So balance bracket or something here I will represent what I am going to pass as an input so in input probably an example it's a string and that string may be like this this one is a balanced one, so it, it should return true. Next input, maybe I'm passing something like so. We have only bracket that only we need to make sure it's balanced or not. So here I am. The output should be false. Okay, so here uh, I need to write some method here. So it will return a boolean and check balance and it will accept a string. So what I am going to do is I need to take each character. So maybe I can convert into a character array initially itself. And I will pass through all the characters. That one. I guess it will be better. So I am going to. No. Oh something weird happen here to carry array so it's a character of array of characters so my string okay so we got everything now I need to go through all this my string right so for each character I need to go through character C okay inside the actually I need a stack here so I already create a stack with the push top so I am using that particular stack okay so initially I will check whether there is any top element in stack if stack top so if I if I am going through the stack, there is no top element what it will return. Since it is minus 1, a minus 1. Okay, I need to add something here. Top is minus one. I will return now. Okay, so I am using that one here, which is not equal to null. Stack top 
it's not equal to null and stack to okay so yeah the thing i missed something here i will take that character first if c equal to this one if it is a closing bracket what i am going to do is i will check whether stack talk is not null and stack talk is equal to opening bracket So in my stack it's object. Okay. So stack top is this one. What I would do is I will pop that item pop up that item if I am getting this one and the item is not that one what I will do I need to yeah here I need to pop push actually check to push we all know that the item is for this for this yeah for this one we are getting this one so we are just push pushing that one into that if it is not that item what I am going to do if it is not that one then I will push that we have only two conditions So for loop will end here and after that we need to make sure stack stack is empty or stack top is null. Okay. If stack top is equal to null, we will return to it is not null, return false. 
Okay. Okay, we'll make it as chatting. Since I need to write the test case inside this class itself, chatting boy main. I have a string that I am passing. Probably I will write a system dot up dot print the line. Said that I am calling this method check balance. Let's see whether it's going to work or not. I am passing a balance one. It should work. See what is going to happen. Because it, was, uh, it will take some time to build. Since I have a lot of programs, and probably I will upload all this program into my blog so people can access that there so here i add another yeah it's false so program looks like good okay it's again run and it's false. There is another condition here. This is another condition. This also we need to make sure whether yeah it's it's true. I'm running this one also. False, yeah. So we are very good actually. It's a a little bit of code. I'm checking whether top is null. If there is, if it is not null, we are putting that into, uh, yeah, pushed into the stack. And we are, if, if it is a balance condition, I will just pop out. So this is a very easy example. Usually in coding interviews, people will ask for these questions. So you can mention you, you, you are creating a stack with pop, pull and top for this particular questions yeah i already created that push pop and top that's it 